Hello and welcome to Wandering Wanda. I'm Rael. Today we are at Stony Creek RV Park in Seward. And look at that majestic view. This is what I'm going to be waking up to. So no ocean view but beautiful mountain view. We have full hookups, 50 amps, sewer, water, water pressure is good. However, as you can see, it's dirt. And the cars driving by this way to get to that part of the RV park, it's just, it's just dust. So I wish they would put down pea gravel or something. There is ample space between the coaches, which is a good thing. So it's nice. Nicely spaced out, there's room for our cars. And we'll go check out the facilities. Office is that way. Haven't been there yet. Isn't that mountain beautiful? Yeah, I don't go out of my way for these things, but I'm just walking by. And apparently this is the dump station. So they got two. One for each side, which is nice. They're a little flooded though. Ew. <laughs> okay, there's the office. It's supposed to have laundry. I might do laundry on our free day. Shower facilities look decent. I wouldn't really go barefoot. <laughs> Yeah, I wouldn't go barefoot. <laughs> Bring your slippers. Washer dryer, 250 each. Yep. <laughs> to dry it though? Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. One, I put it on high heat. Oh well, I put everything in high heat. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so it dry it really good. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> okay, that was. The facility, and that's our group over there making a whole bunch of ruckus. Let me go check out the creek. There's supposed to be a creek here. All right, the next couple of days we're doing some sort of puffin experience at the Marine Center. And then the following day we are going on a cruise, which means I gotta put a patch on, which means a lot of drinking water because that patch, the seasick. Makes me very, very thirsty. But it takes the nauseous away. So would I stay at this park again? The answer would be yes, even though it is a pretty much all dirt. But it's got full hookups. And we are in Alaska in the middle of almost nowhere. So yes, I would stay here again. Look at that view, look at that. It's so magnificent. I'll see you tomorrow and the next day when we do these fantasy tour experiences. Nice. Boy, very good. There you go. There you go. Good job. Oh, thank you. We can pack more bills and more bills. More fish in their bills. In their bills. Um, but again, rain here is not as good as most other birds. No offense, rain. Um, but. <coughs> Okay, this thing must be about 20 feet long. Okay, we are in front of the, what is this called? Alaska Sea Life Center. Really nice. I do agree with what they're doing in regards to rescue and recovery of the wild animals. I don't agree with the philosophy that there's global, global weather change. You know what? Stop having children. The more children you have, the more carbon impact they have. I'm so sick of this climate change crap. Every day there's a climate change. It's called weather. <laughs> All right, so really nice inside. It's a big old aquarium. It's nice. 
there were puffins inside we got to see or up close to the puffins and now we're going to explore seg where are we Stewart. <laughs> Seward we're gonna explore Seward downtown we're gonna walk up the street and down the street and then I'm probably going to go to the National Park Visitor Center. Alright, I just found out that there is a marathon up that mountain where they go running up and then running back down once a year. Okay, I, <laughs> I, I can never do that. So, good for them. Apparently it's becoming worldwide known. And then over here are more glaciers. This is right off Seward. Look at these mountains with all their glaciers. Absolutely beautiful. Magnificent, beautiful. It's right at the edge of town. Kenai Ford stamp. Yeah, yeah. So you have anywhere that we can... Alright, cool, thank you. <laughs> Who wants it? This might be a dumb question. Do all of those things go in the box or something separate? Yay! Our second stamp. Yeah, we need a sticker. That's a sticker. We need a sticker for the stamp. And then we need a pin for the curtain. Which are the you're on tomorrow? You ready? You ready, Anna? Yeah, and I have to bring my talk back. Uh-oh. We didn't quite get it on there. I can't. No, you're Let's see if Dad can do it. Okay, so there's our sticker and our stamp. Yay! Our second stamp. Here we are at Kenai Fjords National Park, and that glacier in the background is Exit Glacier. All right, for you environmental nutcases, this glacier has been receding for the last 200 years. That's before emissions, cars, carbon, and all that crap that you keep spouting. This was horse and buggy time. We did not have carbon burning gasoline or factories, coal, horse and buggy, and burning wood. So your environmentalist crap Again, this has been receding for the last 200 years. Humans did not have an impact on it. It's just natural. It's called weather. 35 years. Right, we're in the center of the road, so I don't get seasick. And I do have my patch on. But we keep stopping for one point. Right now, the there's a pair of balling the socket there. like I was do. They're fixed in position on their nest. They turn their heads all the time. First stop was two otters swimming in the water. It is now 12:30, and I'm there hungry. And nest is right here. Getting a food Up headache. Trees. We need to get going to Fox Island. The young have already flooded out this time of year. Usually. We... Okay, this is Fox Island. We had lunch there. We're getting back on board ship. Okay, there's the name of our okay, ship. Gentlemen, watch your ears one more time. Here comes the final boarding call for the new attack. 